Welcome to Donut and Chill Save the World. The best part of the State of Decay world is the cool survivors we find along the way. The same is true in life. Getting to know you is my favorite part of it all. You will help decide who to recruit, what skill upgrades to choose, and guide the community's decisions. There may even be a few events along the way where you are invited to join me in game. Also, each episode I'll ask a fun question and I'll read your responses in the following episode because the best part of surviving in this world is getting to know the wonderful people in it. Thanks for watching. I hope this video makes your day just a little bit better than it was. Now, let's go save the world. Yeah, they all fall down. All right, we are back with Donut and Chills Save the World. Today, we're going to be taking Chills out. And she's a cool survivor, man. Her name is Chills, former model, paintballer, tech early adopter. And we should get her cardio leveled up. In each episode, we ask you a question and we read your comments in the next episode because I hope this makes your day just a little bit better. I really do. And I hope that we can build a fun community here and get to know each other, make some friends, and uh, maybe even jump into Discord and game together. Last episode, I asked you a little bit about where you grew up and we'll read all those later. I asked you about some donut shops in your area and uh, you gave them to me. You gave them to me. Made me a little bit jealous. Today, favorite like childhood activity, like. Most of us sounds like grew up in the 80s and 90s. I need a heavy weapon, so we're gonna look for a heavy weapon. And um, outside, man, we, I didn't even see that one up there. We hung out in this no place geez. called Outside. No I always like this wall, for no sure. I'm wondering if they know I'm here. Um, basketball, football with the neighborhood, for sure. That's pretty but heavy. for us, it was all about this game called Manhunt. You go out hide and seek two teams. I mean, neighborhood, neighborhood kids. Dude, my best friends are the people right next to me. Because they're right next to me. We gotta get our fighting up anyway. They're fighting up. So, we would play this game called Manhunt. Two teams, one team goes out and hides. The other team has to find them and tag them. And they go to jail, and then your teammates can... Uh, tag you and free you from jail and we'd play at night and it was super intense and I would do anything to get away now I don't care I feel like yeah you found me but I would do anything to get away uh, I mean jump uh, over fences slide under people's porches even strangers hide in the bushes by people's houses like by their front doors I mean whatever it took one particular time went as far as to uh, Slide, running, getting chased by friends in the dark, and um, was running, and this tree was down. I don't remember why it was down. Let's check this for a heavy weapon. And the tree was down. There's a beehive in the tree. Of course we kind of knew that. And I was I running, my adrenaline was pumping, I didn't want to get caught. I didn't want to go to manhunt jail and ran, turned the corner, heading towards that down tree with a beehive in it, and knowing there's a beehive in it, oh sweet, knowing there's a beehive in it, slid like a baseball player right into that beehive, and then just froze and just laid there, adrenaline pumping, just still be because I don't want to get caught. I don't want to go to jail. That's how bad I wanted it. Kids hunting me down, came around the corner, heard the bees. Like, where'd he go? I don't know, where'd he go? I don't know. And I'm just like breathing, controlling my breathing. And bees are flying all over the place. It's dark and I'm sweaty, my adrenaline's pumping. And I'm more afraid of getting caught. Yo, there's a group of arms dealers nearby. Their selection hmm. is massive, but the prices are high. Maybe we should check them out. Yeah, I think so. More afraid of getting caught than stung by the bees. And I didn't get stung. They were all over in that bush, in that tree. I didn't get stung and I didn't get caught. And your boy didn't get caught. So, Manhunt, shout out to Robin and Amy and Jason and Travis and Josh and Andrew. The neighborhood. The neighborhood, man. It was so good. Life was so good. A lot of you talked about that, um, that era. And I'm glad you got to grow up in that era for sure. Okay, I don't have good meds. We're going to go hit a heart. Talk to Donut. We want to check that. We want to check that um, enclave of arms dealers. Now, 
I don't really want to shoot it out with anybody at this point. Dude, where is the fella? Dude, are you way up there? Where'd he go? Oh, he's right there. Good thing I didn't climb up there. Yo, watch yourself out there. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's see how badly he's hurt. Oh, 109 out of 112. Okay, he's the dude's fine. It's almost elevated from citizen. Yep. The other thing about these two, Donut and Chills, is uh, Donut worked at the donut shop, obviously. Um, Chills would frequent the donut shop. And um, obviously, Donut got to kind of like in Chills. But he never had the right pickup line. You see where I'm going with this? Give me a good pickup line. Clean. Clean pickup line. You can push it a little bit, but don't get, you know. Kids watch this stuff. Just bear that in mind. I don't know if I want to do this one. I think there's a peaceful resolution to this. I don't remember. We'll head down that way and check it out. I have another task for you. Details forthcoming. So, like, are you from Tennessee? Because you're the only 10 I see. These will be fun to read next episode. Now, if you can make one up, like you made it up, Nobody told you about this when you freaking made it up. You need to put like a winky face after you say it. That'll let me know that you made this thing up. I'm going the wrong way. All right, let's go get, the oh, a police car. Oh, this just got interesting. I haven't, I haven't had one of those in a while, man. Does not look like it's in great shape. We'll get it later when, oh crap, probably in worse shape. When I'm, um, I just filled this one with gas, so let's use it. That'll be fun. Moves fast. So I made one up. Now this is for advanced minds, all right? And if you're single, this one won't fail you, all right? You won't be single for long. Um, let's loot this. Here it is. Myster I love mysterious broadcasts. I love them. Because you never know what you're gonna get into. They are mysterious. It's in the title. Here's mine. I made it up. Only the best and the brightest will get this one. Are you ready? Here's you go up to the lady or the fella. And you say this. Are you a palm tree? <laughs> because I want to hold your hand. <laughs> who gets it? I kind of want to explain, but I kind of want to see who gets it. Are you a palm tree? Because I want to hold your hand. My kids cringe. They've made up a bunch. I need to get them on here and just reciting them. They're so fun. So dumb. Is that a bloater? Ooh. Really looking forward to getting this cardio up. One more star. We here. should get it today. There's usually a meds rock, sometimes a first aid kit around these parts. We can put this to good use. Certainly can. Get that cardio up. Are you a palm tree? Because I want to hold your hand. <laughs> Tell me if you get it in the comments. That's so dumb. But the, the worse it is, the better it is. So give me maybe your favorites. I've seen it top to bottom. Um, no more of that. Now. Your favorites or better yet, make one up. I made that up. Made it up. I'm very proud of it. Very proud. Um, mysterious broadcast. What? What? Why is it way over there? I don't care about the warlord weapons for all. I think that... I think they get kind of like... Not happy. I don't need this. Let's uh, make some space. I know it's good for like... It's good to you know, grind it down in the parts, but I'm not, we're, we're playing with some detail, but not that much detail. Like, we'll be okay. We do want to get more survivors because in case of a base siege, in case of a base siege, we need some defenses and we need some people, some bodies, some warm bodies that ain't dead yet. Ooh, hidden weapons crate. Let's get it up here. Um, I might've missed it. What do I got here? Some rando. Okay. 
Um, so we were debating the only rule to the series really is do we am I allowed to prevent infestation sieges siege infestations and I think what I'll say now is at least for the first one I won't touch the first one but if there's a second and a third I'll go take those out. and we'll see how it goes I do love these survivors I love donut I love chills but hey man this is the apocalypse anyone can go at any time but the argument was strong it was hey if this is a chill series oh that's nice if this is just like a fun relaxing series why do that and that's that's a valid point so keep letting me know what you think i don't need this seed can i stack those uh okay i can't i thought i had um more chemicals it's funny that the chemicals are what you use this is a load and a half to make energy drinks. That's kind of scary, because I love energy drinks. Uh, good stuff, but we'll leave it. Okay, so we got some good weapons now. Um, I guess let's, let's head down here. We'll keep heading towards that mysterious broadcast. We'll hit a heart along the way, possibly. Okay, that does not look like a good idea. Oh, shoot. That guy could knock me off the cliff. Yeah, so uh, childhood kind of growing up activity. Was it Nintendo? Was it um, sledding? Was it... I mean, get unless it's all you can think of, I'd say get past the main sports. Unless that's, that's what we got. Was your thing? I mean, great. My skin is crawling. Must but something maybe that not everyone by. did would be cool, too. But hey, I, dude, I love playing football in the snow, man. Oh, so great. Neighborhood, same neighborhood kids, man. Josh, Travis, my brother... Um, and my brother's so cool. He Any would. You can help us out over here? Maybe. He would, whether I was right or wrong, throw punches for me in a moment's notice without even being asked. Yelling out, That's my brother! I want the light, but I don't want the car to get wrecked. This place is disgusting. Let's go, let's go. I'd like to get a powerhouse as my character, as my play card assault guy. It's in bad shape. Work out. Mmm, tempted to use the Molly. But I did. I don't know if that was enough time yet. Maybe. Yeah, we're good. Good, let's go. Hope you're having a good Saturday. Okay, all out. Hopefully this finishes it. Nice. I always aim high like my dreams. Damn, I really like taking back territory from the Z's. Rip it. Nice. Okay. Let's go check this mysterious broadcast. Nice, nice, nice. They need, it's even way past the mark, man. What are they doing? Give me something way down here. Yeah, but my brother would be like, that's my brother, and then just tackle someone like in punches, just being thrown without even knowing the details of the situation. 
super loyal. And now that we're in our 40s, nothing has changed. He would do the same. Except now the guy's a monster, dude. He's like 6'2", 240. He's done one licensed MMA fight. And he did it in his 30s, so super old to be doing that crap. And he won by decision. And retired. For the sole fact that for the rest of his life, he can say, and still undefeated. <laughs> and so if I call him, there's a good chance he won't even say hello. He'll launch straight into, I'll go ring, ring, and then he'll pick up and go, and still undefeated. That was years ago. But he technically is still undefeated, undefeated. So you got to know when to call something, man. You got to go out on top. What do we got up here? We got some sort of supply drop. Something going down. Oh, let's check with our dude. Oh, dude, he's Java. Java freaking went up one of those 700 feet when he was in the Coast Guard. I was like asking a question in a DayZ video. Whoa, would you do that for $20,000? Because I saw, saw a video about that. Freaking dude did it for nothing. I mean, because he's a monster. So what's what am I doing? Travel to the rust. Okay. Mysterious broadcast, okay. Investigate the strange signal, okay. Hmm. Hmm. Search and retrieve the contents of the Clio drop in the area. This is good. I'm not gonna have much space, but that's okay. Let's let's prepare for some some space. Uh, we can drop these. We can I like the chemicals, man. We can store those. Um I drop these. I hate dropping a soda can bomb. I guess I could drop the snacks. I hate doing this. I almost want an outpost, but there's going to be good stuff here. I guess I could go see what's in there before I drop all this stuff. But what's done is done. Yeah, you got to know when to how to quit when you're ahead, uh, I think. Not quit, but... Go out on a high note, if possible. Okay, so they're not going to make this super easy for me. But it's not super hard either. I got this soda can bomb. No door. I gotta be careful because I don't have like repair kits and stuff. Okay. Yeah, I really need to be careful with this car. Oh, that dude's right on it. That ain't right. I need a break. I need him to follow me. Now I wish I had those snacks. Dude's not gonna follow me. Or is he? Come on. You ever feel like that on cardio day, guys? Come on, dude. Okay. All those noisemakers I've dropped along the way, kind of regretting that. But you know, we gotta get our fighting up. We gotta get our cardio up. Yeah, still at one star to go. All right, here, the perfect time. This is fun. Yeah, they all fall down. That was cool. I'm slowing down. No, you're good. You're good. Wish I had those snacks. Go chills. Flawlessly executed. Love the notes. Love the notes. Uh, I want to collect all the notes, but oh, I love this. Yes, that'll be her weapon. What do we got? Gambler hat. 
No room for that. Can I just add it to a gun? Okay. No room for that. Um. 1345 caliber rounds or this note. Cleo inactive. The note is a great keepsake. I'm gonna take. Psh, you guys are gonna think I'm crazy. We appreciate your I'm taking the note. And I wanna see it explode, so. Let's take the last thing. Here we go. It wouldn't have hurt me. I didn't, didn't have to run, but. Hmm. Let's, let's go see if there's anything else I can dump out of the car. Let's go, Cardio Star. Oh, there's a whole space. Now we're getting some good guns. That's pretty heavy. I get some good guns. So I have, how many things did I want to pick up? One? I want the note. I want to keep them. Let's go. Er, give me that last star. I want it so bad. Okay. Um, I think we head back. Back towards town. Do a little bit of looting. And while we're driving and looting, I'll be reading your comments. So this mic in front of me will go mute. And then, because I need, I found that I can read the comments a lot smoother when I'm not multitasking. So, um, we'll read your comments back, y'all. And, uh, have some fun with that. Thanks for everything. And here we go. Alright, we're about to get into the comments. Before we do, I do need to let you know. I do stop by a base that I have my forever community on, and I wait for my guy Donut to come help me when I get mobbed by zombies. And he doesn't help me, and I get a little angry at him. Like, where is this dude? I'm at the base. And then I realize I'm at the wrong base. But watch how long it takes me to realize I'm at the wrong base. <laughs> Embarrassing. Like, oh, I can edit that out, but nah, nah. If you've done that before, let me know in the comments. You drive to a base that's not your base because you have it in a different community. And <laughs> I fought off all these zombies. Like, where's freaking Donut? Why is he coming out here? I stopped here to have him help me. If I anyway. take out the nearest play card, uh, Also, at the end of the video, we do get chills uh, leveled up in cardio. So let me know what your vote is for that. Jay from Texas. I grew up in Southeast Texas. I grew up in the 80s, and I thank God I got to grow up before cell phones ruined everything. I agree 100%. I love the world before the internet, although, the internet is what is allowing us to enjoy this uh, friendship here, but it was a special time. Celia903, joint member, really appreciate you and your support for the channel. Says, I grew up on the rough side of Chicago, Illinois. We had Dunkin' Donuts, but my town was known for their fast food like Italian beef, gyros, pizza puffs, and super tacos. Oh, I miss those places. The town I live in now has a Mary Lou's Donut. That's pretty good. Mary Lou, I like the sound of that. Let's keep that one in the holster. See what else we come up with. So tired. Wayne, casually open the door on pedestrians in Australia. We save that for cyclists wearing Lystra, Lycra. I don't know. I don't get it. I'll read it out. Maybe you do. Love you, Wayne. You comment on all my videos. Huge supporter of the channel. Patrick, I'm in Jacksonville, Florida. Grew up in Chicago, Illinois. So, a few Chicagoans, Chicagoites. Ah, whatever. But uh, you escaped the cold. Good on you. Jacksonville, Florida. Sounds amazing. Now, watch out for them gators, though, right? I don't know much about that. I grew up in Bayview, small city outside of Milwaukee. I live in St. Francis, again, a small city outside of Milwaukee. Uh, I love about, I live about half a block from the airport, General Mitchell International Airport. Hmm. There is an awesome bakery called OH in Racine. That's uh, further south towards Wisconsin, Illinois border. Incredible Kringles and donuts. Now, I didn't know what a Kringle was. Don't judge me. But Voodoo, he texted me and uh, he told me all about them and invited me to a Kringle shop out there by Milwaukee. And he's thinking about making a trip to California. We do, man. We got to meet up and grab lunch. I'm planning lunch with Java. I've had a couple lunches with Yor, a.k.a. Phil, a.k.a. Battle Lord Omega. So it could happen. That would be way cool. Grimma, 1978. I'm in Sweden. Sweden. And uh, Donut should use that cooking book. Donut should use the cooking book. Okay, that was a great move because he has an open fifth skill. But I kind of want his fifth skill to be like hygiene or... Uh, lichenology or fishing 
something better than cooking because there's a lot of cooks out there but for his storyline that would make perfect sense so i like the way that you think on that uh grimma also says i'm excited for this series i also agree with your rule of keeping all siege infestations for some random chaos to keep you on your toes noted thank you rob dead i grew up in cornwell cornwall excuse me england uh, surfing and chasing summertime holiday gals. Great youth. I live in Vietnam now. Wow. I'd say don't let the siege rule get too nasty. Um, if you want this to be a chill run, I mentioned this comment earlier, make it so. You've already shown you can be extreme a hardship survivor. That's true. I've done a ton of crazy extreme stuff. If you want to see the extreme stuff, check out the playlist on the channel. I think for now we split the difference. I allow one siege infestation unless you guys are like no you'll get overrun but not the second or a third because i've seen it where seconds and thirds show up les allen huge supporter of the channel you demand i was born in surrey england my parents from london obviously <laughs> obvious i mean i i even knew that but i grew up in sussex southeast of england honestly i've heard of all those towns which is amazing um a town called eastbourne haven't heard of that one sorry in the 80s uh, we didn't have much money, but we learned to appreciate the small things. Didn't Don't live there anymore. Uh, we had a donut store called the Donut King. Donuts were massive and tasty. Donut King and Mary Lou's. These are good. Good donuts. Wayne. There's only one donut shop. Krispy Kreme. <laughs> it is special, man. It's good. If you've never had it, let me know. It's pretty special. Bry the Fry Guy. I love the name. Grew up in New York, still in New York. I mean, I'm a New Yorker on my um, birth certificate. Albany, New York. Not a New York City guy, upstate, but um, I don't know, Empire State. Philip says, good luck, my friend. Chief, K2373, grew up in D.C., was kind of partial to Safeway's Fresh Baked Donuts, so I'm not the only one who chose a bakery from a grocery store. That's good to know. Hey. Mark Miller. Mark on? Miller was the mastermind behind the Joker series. So if you haven't seen the Joker series, watch it. I'll try to remember to link it at the end. Mark, you to me. Uh, just listening to that intro genuinely picked me up. That's That warms my heart, pal. It really does. Because I want to just be an uplifting presence. Uh, anytime I walk in a room, I want people to feel like, all right, it's gonna be, day's going to be a little bit better. And that includes on your phones and such. Uh, it's not been the best week for me. Hey, we're with you, man. But the video helped. Uh, looking forward to the series. Maybe I can join you one day. You absolutely can. I put my gamer tag uh, in the response in the comment there. Oh, hit me up on Discord. If you want. Um, hit me up on Discord. I'll even give you my number. It's, I'm not that picky about it. Um, for sure. Hey, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be all right, Mark. Donor blessing, pal. Patrick. Best donuts in Chicago. Old fashioned donuts. 112 in Michigan Ave. Sounds amazing. MP. Uh, I said after that. Curran, Donut King uh, in Massachusetts. Alright, we got two Donut Kings. Massachusetts. Uh, we got it right up in the Boston Globe. Where was the other Donut King? Did we get two Donut Kings? Scrolling. Alright, well that's that's about all the comments for now. Um, I'm I look forward to reading these pickup lines, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. Kringles. OH Bakery. Man, good stuff. I'll give it some more thought. See if we want to slap a name on it. King Donuts. We have Ouchie on his shirt. So, Ouchie Donuts. But what city is it from? Maybe we go with that. And you know what? Um, Voodoo's been my now. friend for a long time back. Um, so, we're going to say he worked in Ohio. In Rancine, Ohio. If I'm saying that right. Rancine, Ohio. Uh, at Ouchie Donuts. And they specialized in Kringles. And that's where this we're going to go totally with. I love yeah. the comments, y'all. Love it. All right. Um, you can kind of watch. Uh, I um, drive around. I don't say much for a bit. At the end, though, I do find out what our skill upgrade options are for our girl chills. Locked. And I need to know what you think because you guide and direct this, these things. Also, no one answers. If I see, I like, the nine-minute countdown for the siege coming to my base and I... Exit the game. Will that siege pop up immediately next time? But only this time, I got some of you guys with me, my pals, to defend the base. That would be a great opportunity for some multiplayer. Uh, and maybe we do like the legacy missions together in multiplayer. Um, you can always hit me up in Discord, and I'll try to include you in 
live streams next week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. I'm planning live streams at 8 p.m. Eastern. Try to give the channel a little boost heading into summer. So I'll be looking for those. Um, that's it, guys. Love you. Good night. God bless. This isn't the end of the video. So we'll keep gaming right now, and then we'll game straight through the apocalypse. I'm sure I'm done reading the comments by now. Loot around a little bit. Still waiting for that. Oh, Cardio Star. Oh! I say we go Powerhouse. But I'm going to leave it to you guys. If we go Powerhouse, Chills becomes our Plague Heart attacker. And we build out the rest of her stuff to kill Plague Hearts. Powerhouse doesn't come up as much as Marathon and Backpacking. So... I really want to go powerhouse, but I'm going to let you guys vote. We said we'd let you guys vote. I'm not going to do the thing like my dad used to do, where we're a family of five and we're going to put it to a vote, but his vote counts as ten. Started seeing right through that one after a few years. All right, powerhouse, marathon, our girl chills is level up, and I need to get the freaking notifications unless I was there and I just didn't see it. Uh, but hey, thanks for watching. Your pickup lines, those are going to be awesome to read next episode. I'm trying to get these videos out about every other day, just FYI. At least three a week, because this is freaking fun. Thanks for watching, everybody. And like I said, I hope this makes your day a little bit better. I know there's a lot of suffering and grief out there. Always feel free to reach out in the comments, in Discord, link below. Happy to pray for you. Happy to be a support to you. And um, yeah, dude, what a brilliant, what a brilliant fun game. Look at this. Look at the details. We all got rakes like that one. It's amazing. Yeah, we don't all have fire barrels, but coolers in that box fan. We all probably got one of those lying around. Try to read that, but it's all good. All right. Could play this all day, but I got other things I got to do. Love you guys. And uh, we're going to keep gaming straight through the apocalypse. Chills. <laughs>